It's me Morgan and I'm finally making this video on how I curl my hair um, when I curl it to get that look that you guys seem to like that I post on Instagram with my hair. So um, yeah, so this is what I do. So first of all, this hair is the Sassy Mitchell hair. It's the natural curly and I like to wear it flex, flex, either flexi rod it or wand it with the curling wand. And um, yeah, it's a, a wig. Well, not, well, I made it into, it's not a U part, but I made it into a wig. So I used the Ivy Pals method, and I'll leave that below. But it's the flip over method. So it gives you that, like, you know, deep side looking part. So I'm gonna show you what I do, how to get the look that I wear all the time. So first, I'm just gonna take my hair and part it in half. I'm just gonna tie it around. Okay, so I'm going to be using this curling wand that I broke. <laughs> um, yeah, it's pretty bad. I got it from New Me, and yeah. So this is it, it's the reverse curling wand, and I love this curling wand because it's different, and <laughs> it goes from small to large, and I like the way the curls come out better with this. So yeah, this is from New Me, and I'm also going to use this this is like a product I love. It's the Organics Argan Oil and Shea Butter Balm Moisture Restore Weightless Oils. I'm gonna use this, so I'm gonna get started. So I did part my hair already, and I'm gonna take like two pumps of the oil. It's not heavy at all. <coughs> and I'm gonna put it through my hair. And I always seem to do the side with the least amount of hair first. I don't know why. But yeah, so I'm just gonna comb it all through the hair. And then I'm gonna take a bottom section. And I'm gonna curl that first. So I'm gonna tie that up, okay? So I'm gonna use my Demon brush to like detangle any of the tangles in it. Okay, so I have this section. I'm going to split it in half and I'm going to take my curling wand and see how big this section is. You can do it however you want. Uh, I like doing like a medium to larger section because um, I like the hair like really big. And if you do a smaller section, it still can get big when you pick it out, but the curls are going to be more defined. But I like that natural curl fluffy look. So I'm gonna take my curling wand and just wrap it around. And I hold it on for like, it depends if I'm in a rush or not. And right now I kinda am in a rush and wanna get my hair over with. So I'll leave it on for like five to seven seconds. And also when you pull the hair out, make sure you hold on to that bottom and pull it out like that. So the curls can come out really pretty. So this is what, it looks like so I'm just gonna take that I'm gonna throw it back throw it back there <laughs> and I'm going to do this piece do 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 one two three four five six seven and release okay so that's what these two look like and I promise you, this is all I do throughout the whole head. It's super easy. I'm gonna get some more hair. I'm gonna pin that up. Brush. And this curling wand is like so amazing. I did buy it with my own money. And um, I went on the website and it was like, it said like a hundred or two hundred something dollars. Then I was searching for a coupon code and it was a coupon code for like a hundred and fifty dollars off. So I ended up paying $59.99 or $49 something for the curling wand and that was it. So if I can find that code, I will leave it below for you guys or it might be cheaper on the site now. I'm not sure because I got this a while ago. So yeah, so I'm just gonna keep curling the hair. And a lot of you ask me if I 
do this every day to my hair. I only curl my hair with a curling wand. Um, I usually only curl it like this on weekends uh, when I go out. But throughout the week, I do like to wrap my hair at night now again. And the curls come out somewhat like this. Not exactly the same, but it does come out like this kind of. So yeah. It's looking like on this side I'm already done with this one side so this is what it looks like after I complete that side so now I'm going to move on to the other side and I do it the exact same way as I did this side I don't flip the curls the other way or anything like that it's all the same way so yeah I'm going to speed through it so you guys don't have to sit there and watch the whole thing so I know it's so boring so yeah <laughs> So this is what it looks like after I curl it without picking it out or anything. But I do, do need to go through the front, straighten my hair. Cause I did go out yesterday and it was a little humid and my hair kind of sweated out a little bit. So just going to straighten it out. Tide. And I usually don't do this because usually I'll lay my lay the front of my hair down, but I don't have enough time to do that. So yeah, so I just straighten it out like that. Okay, so what I do now is I just start picking the hair apart and playing with it. It looks like I have like a hump on top of my head. <laughs> yeah, just pick the hair apart. In the back, I usually just like comb out. And make sure you got that flip thing going on in the front and bam. So yeah. I don't know why it looks bigger on camera than it does in this mirror right here, but I don't know. Okay, so big hair, don't care, you know. So this is what it looks like. This is how I achieved that look, that um, big curly hair, my signature look now that I adopted because I love wearing my hair like this. And yeah, Ugh, okay. So yeah, so this is it and as you can see, it definitely is like that deep side part. And the way I get this is just following Ivy's method. Um, I'm going to try to record a video on how I do my hair, how I make my um, wig <laughs> with it, um, with using her methods. So yeah, so this is it. Beautiful curls. I'll turn around so you can see the back of my hair. So I hope you like it and that's it. If you have any questions or comments, let me know. But this is my signature curly hair look. I do with my curling wand. It usually takes me about 20, depends how fast I go, 20 to 30 minutes to do it. 
So yeah, and if you guys are interested in seeing my makeup video, I did one before this video on how I do my foundation, then I'll leave the link below. You guys can click on that to see. So thank you for watching, bye.